Election day is less than three weeks away, and on Wednesday, we heard from local candidates for state house at a forum hosted by the League of Women Voters and the North Hennepin Area Chamber of Commerce. A big topic both statewide and here in the northwest suburbs is how to pay for roads. Three candidates running to represent Brooklyn Park in the Minnesota House weighed in on the issue. I think we need a dedicated, stable source of funding for transportation. And I do not believe that comes from increasing the gas tax. We do have the opportunity to dedicate existing taxes on auto repair, auto parts, and car leases. Currently, this money is money is being used in the general fund. We should set it aside solely for road and bridge repairs. Parts of our local and county tax and the city taxes and our county tax also go to fund our roads. And so there's a mixture of what's paid for that. As was said here, I do support raising the gas tax because again, it's constitutionally dedicated and cannot be stole out of the fund for other, for, or other purposes. Where it's more difficult for us is that we have our gas tax frozen at a certain cents per gallon. And so unlike the property tax and the income tax that fluctuate with inflation, the gas tax is static and it relies on policymakers to go in and make inflationary adjustments. We can't buy asphalt to pave our roads or concrete to pave our roads for the same price that we could in 2008 when the gas tax was last passed. Dedicating sales tax revenues from auto repair and auto parts for roads and bridges would require lawmakers to amend the state constitution. District 36B Republican candidate Jermaine Bazio did not attend the forum.